Hi Aquarius, thank you for joining me. You're here with Bella Katrina, the Galactic Palladian Blu-ray Transmission Federation of Light. Welcome. So thank you for joining me, for clicking on my reading and, and hello to my regular subscribers. I thank you for your comments and your support. We've just been through a massive portal of... Um, Bringing down Aurora, Princess Aurora's Divine Love Template, Christos and Sophia uniting within you. So that's the Christ consciousness. And how can you have Christ consciousness without Christ? That's what I would like to know. So we do here at Bella Katrina, we have Christ consciousness and we receive healing, blessings and guidance as we go through the reading. We're doing a Shabam here for Aquarius month of November for love and romance. And we also have Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael and the Romance Angels. We're going to do a snapshot, see the energy of love and the vibration and also find out at Vimeo um, the extra, extra love extension of the healing that you'll be needing. And I'll tell you also about your beloved, how they're coming towards you, how they're viewing you and what's going to happen coming up into the new moon in December. Your first message, your faith hath saved you. Go in peace. Luke 7.50 Reconciling your soul back to God. And having faith in he, that he sent his son, Jesus Christ, saves your soul from Satan and you go in peace. So if you're wanting to experience divine grace and peace, there's nothing like it. There's another message here for Aquarius. What things soever you desire, when you pray, believe that you receive them and you shall have them. Mark eleven twenty four. So again, it's only your belief. It's your belief that Jesus is listening to you. It's your belief that you can have them through his name. We say thank you, God, from whose word all things came to be. Divine love expressing through me now draws to me all that is needed to make me happy and my life complete. These are affirmations you can say out loud every day. It changes your vibration. We're going to have a look at the Love Oracle at Vimeo and also the Romance Angels. And also I have messages from the Earth Angels. And I'm going to be going into that extended for the Elementals, Star People and Walk-Ins at my Vimeo channel extended read reading. And a message around your love life from Archangel Raphael, the healing angel. If you would like to, we're going to just open you up to receive some healing emerald ray from Raphael. Archangel Raphael, I now open to receiving your emerald healing ray of light into my heart chakra. You can also just close your eyes and just imagine being showered with a green healing mist going into your auric field and being absorbed through your skin. Staying positive at this time, Aquarius, please stay positive and ask the angels for help, especially Raphael, the angel of healing, and also the patron saint of relationships. So dear Archangel Raphael, Thank you for helping me to be optimistic and to take the appropriate action steps that support my health and well-being and that of my relationship. So I'm getting that you've been through a little bit of a confusing time in your love life for those of you who are partnered. Just say this out loud. God's love in me now draws to me my beloved, the one who is mine by divine right. I praise divine love that there is a strong way out of this dilemma. And then hand it over, relax and open up your clairvoyance, your clairsentience, your clairaudience and your claircognizance. Right there, your clairs, that's your... Um, senses and that's how the angels talk to you and jesus son of god your creator archangel michael what message do you have for aquarius concerning their love life in november so archangel michael is saying not enough of you call upon him because he can't intervene without your permission and the same goes for your guardian angel 
So that's why we ask. And we say thank you as well. A favourable outcome. So this will be balanced and fair. And thank you, Archangel Michael, for the beautiful outcome to this situation, which is perfect and fair for everyone involved. Thank you, Archangel Michael, for helping me trust and have faith. Just know the whole galaxy is watching you and this is what you look like when you light up. When you do your Reiki mastership, we do Reiki symbols, the galaxy can see this light. The Reiki light, they've been telling me they can see it. When you receive the Holy Spirit in your body, God can see you light up and activates your Merkaba here and that's when we're going to beam out and go to the fifth dimension. Prayer will help with this situation, so just praying out loud for me now, remembering the universal law of free will means you can't they can't intervene without your permission including god dear god and archangel michael and jesus i ask for your divine intervention with my relationship with my soulmate or my twin flame i welcome your help and i trust and follow your guidance with gratitude and grace i need a miracle and i ask that you send one to me and this situation quickly Thank you. Amen. Wow. You need a miracle? Thank you for helping me have faith so I can open my heart wider in my relationships. I am grateful for your protection, ensuring that only trustworthy people are in my life. All right, so this is about you knowing that you can trust yourself, trust your gut when you get into the present moment and out of the mind matrix. You can trust this person. This is the one you're thinking of. Now we're going to have a snapshot here of the Lucy Cavendish Tarot and see what's happening in the energy field. Sorry about that. Holy are you, Lord, full of power and might. The heavens declare your glory. And as the plant yearns for living waters, so my soul longs for you. Give me the strength to live for you, Lord, until you come for me in all your glory lovely things to say this is lucy cavendish tarot snapshot i just got an excitement in my belly for you coming up a surprise a delight a squeal of ex ecstasy let's have a look for aquarius just a snapshot of their energy for coming up november to the new moon in december please what do they need to know about their love life their beloved or opening their heart to new love thank you thank you so there it is. Look, you are always kissing someone, aren't you, Aquarius? <laughs> There's a kissy, kissy mama here. Now, also, I get decision that you may have to choose between two partners, but the universe is going to help you on that if you just wait and relax and let go because you don't want to be controlled any longer. You don't want any feelings of being less than in a relationship especially. So there is a big part of something that you're letting go of because you've taken a stand in this relationship and said, you have to come to me. It's like my way needs to be um, discussed as well. So you've taken a stand and then you've sat in that stand and that's been four weeks and then you've had to release something like realizing that you don't want to be in that energy of feeling controlled, right? This is a devil attachment energy. And they're showing me that you are letting it go. Like you've already let it go on a spiritual level and a mental level. It's just emotionally now because the healing has to occur. So you're in a healing mode. You're also connecting to the galaxy to um, this is your Merkaba that I was talking about. So this is your galactic family of light and your a lot of you are Lyrians they're showing me from or from Sirius or Pleiades right so they're blue rays or star seeds it's a big portal you're going through at the moment through this um, month of November creating at an all-time high you've got galactic brothers and sisters watching us the whole galaxy is watching us this is a gigantuan task releasing this control template right of service to self and putting in the new template of service to others. And so here is an, a big opportunity coming up also in your career advancement, I see, and connecting to technology and getting your a message out. 
to the galaxy, to the galaxy. So this is your next four weeks letting go of anything that doesn't serve you. The universe is going to help you. Please just let it go. If it not, if it's not working, if you feel controlled, if you feel clenched in the stomach or feel that anyone's draining your power, you ask Archangel Michael to disconnect and you call in. I call in my Palladian brothers and sisters or my starseed galaxy galaxy family you call them in and they speak to you telepathically and you uh, you say that because this is an upgrade needed here because it's like you got rid of the jezebel spirit this is the jezebel spirit released from your system because of the high upgrade this is getting a upgrade on your dna so you're going to be feeling it so you may feel lethargic a little bit slow in energetic field right so just know that it's a change over time it's like taking out um you know an old power circuit and getting a new power circuit that's where you're at we're getting a message here from the um keepers of the light oracle just to see who's with you in november and then we're going to have a snapshot at who's coming towards you or how your partner's viewing you or what you need to know and then we go into at vimeo the first week or the you know the second week coming up the third week and into the new moon and just follow your relationship that way and bring in your healing and guidance the romance angels and um the love oracle at vimeo so please go there. Kuan Yin's here for you. So I'm bringing in a, a Reiki symbol from Kuan Yin. And it's about caring, compassion, and I get of yourself because you're very caring. And if you're lit up, you know you can just walk through a shopping center and everybody will feel your vibration and heal. That's what these star seeds are. Isn't that amazing? So what I've learned in my journey is it's more important, especially through Reiki, that's what I teach, is to look after oneself first. Choose to be love. Do what is right for everyone involved and offer a helping hand. Allowing Kuan Yin to come in to care for you right now. So we're going to do a healing with Kuan Yin, also at Vimeo, because she has an opalescent healing light. So having a snapshot here of how your partner's coming towards you in the next seven days from watching this video. And then we'll go into the next 14 days and up until December on Vimeo. So thank you for being here with me. I'm going to read to you now Matthew 19, 26. But Jesus looked at them and said, With man this is impossible, but with God all things are possible. In the last days... God says, I will pour out my spirit upon all people. Your sons and daughters will prophesy. Your young men will see visions and your old men will dream dreams. Acts 2.17 So even as the angels at night time help me remember my dreams upon awakening, Archangel Michael come into my dreams tonight and every night. Replace all fear with faith, trust, courage and confidence so that I can step forward fearlessly. Or so that I can have my next step, you know, known to me upon awakening. I don't know why I had these upside down. Ugh. So I got this exciting rush again. So whether this is over or you're in separation, um, something really good's about to happen. <laughs> So just wipe those last tears away, Aquarius, right? There's a separation here from a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They are not, they're in a low self-esteem energetic field, right? And they don't have their, um, they don't have their home situation set up how they want it yet. They're filling out in the cold. So maybe having to do, this is like having to do shift work, haven't got themselves together, not in a peaceful frame yet. However, it is going to balance. You're moving forward and moving on from feeling left to out. And you're reminiscing about lost love and past loves and how that you want commitment. So this is a letting go of the old passion and moving into I want love. Right, And that's why you've brought some peace of mind here. It's been a very big spiritual lesson with this fire sign or with this passionate affair. The lesson being that you don't just want passion, you need connection and love. And here's your card underneath Aquarius. This is your card, the star card, connecting to the galaxy. Again, we've got it. So please go outside, lay on the grass under the moonlight 
and the stars. And I just started saying, galactic beings of light, show me your ways. Because I heard a guy on a video saying that. And then I actually um, got connection and then I did a, um, a call to them and a ritual and brought them in. And so I've met them and done massive, um, like unbelievable healings. So this is you receiving your DNA upgrade, receiving your healing, letting go of all the yuck yuck so that you can just become light and getting back to your true self, your true nature, you know, like less makeup, less um, aftershave, you know, less um, accessories like watches, leaving your phone at home more often, just going into nature without having anything in your ears, no earphones, no music. You know, this is getting back in touch with the natural frequency, the 725 hertz. If you can play that and listen to that, because look, this is your blueprint. This is what you came here to do. This is the changeover. And you are in the best place because you cleared the past. If you're still clearing it, get my magic healing package. It's one session a week for four weeks. And it helps you clear, balance, ground and protect your energy. Get back into the present moment so that you can hear your guidance, create and receive healing. Because underneath there's new love coming in the Ace of Cups. And... Moving back into feelings of being worthy of love. So I am worthy of love and I am loved. And as we sign off here, we just ask Father God in Jesus' mighty name to break every curse of depression or addiction that has been placed on your life because of any compulsion or compulsive behaviors, every curse and evil spirit on your finances or health. I decree and declare in the mighty name of Jesus that you are blessed and cannot be cursed. And you now go from glory to glory and have a supernatural encounter with your Saviour, Jesus Christ. O oh my Jesus, you said truly I say to you, ask and you shall receive, seek and you shall find, knock, and it shall be opened unto you. Behold, I knock, I seek, and I ask for the grace of this intention. So just say your wish or your intention. And then we're going to just say thank you, Father. And to the sacred heart of Jesus, I place all my trust in you. If you haven't taken Jesus as your Lord and Savior, Judgment Day is coming. We're at the end of the book of Revelation in the Bible. It's time to reconcile your soul back to Prime Creator. If you would like to ask any questions on that, comment below. Thank you for your connection here. And we're going to go into Vimeo now. If you would like a private reading with me, go to reikibarbella.com, get a free upgrade or get your activations in Reiki Level 1, 2 and 3. I can't wait to connect with more of you. And thank you so much for supporting my Vimeo channel, which is new. So we're going there to have um, the healing with... Um, Kuan Yin and to go right into the Romance Angels and the next two weeks and three weeks coming into December New Moon to find out what love is in store for you and to bring in some healing guidance and messages. I love you lots. Thanks for watching and bye for now.